For decades now, scientists have been on a hunt, a hunt for glowing, colorful ribbons of light, or what's called auroras. Here's a look at Neptune's ring in more than 30 years. Mm, look at that. Cool. You're seeing them. NASA recently released a set of startling observations that have shaken the scientific community's long-held assumptions about Neptune. The planet, often overshadowed by its more charismatic neighbor Saturn and the massive Jupiter, has historically held the status of a cold, stable, and relatively quiet giant. Nestled nearly 3 billion miles from the Sun, it has been presumed to be a fairly well-understood ice giant, one defined by high-pressure ices, a thick hydrogen-helium atmosphere, and violent but predictable weather systems. That assumption, however, has been fundamentally challenged by new data beamed back from both Earth-based telescopes and deep space observational platforms. What NASA's teams uncovered was not just a tweak in current models, it was a wholesale upheaval of what scientists thought they knew about Neptune's internal mechanics, magnetic anomalies, and even its place in the larger story of planetary evolution. Before we start, smash the like and subscribe buttons for more updates. The primary discovery that set the tone for this shift came in the form of unexpected magnetic field readings. Using a combination of data from the Hubble Space Telescope, the Chandra X-ray Observatory, and radio spectrometry tools aboard probes and orbital stations, researchers noticed a staggering inconsistency in Neptune's magnetic topology. Unlike Earth, which has a magnetic field relatively aligned with its rotational axis, Neptune's magnetic field appeared tilted by nearly 47 degrees. This fact was not new in itself, but what shocked researchers was the degree to which that tilt was changing in real time. Over just a few short years, a blink in cosmic terms, the tilt had shifted measurably, with parts of the field distorting in strange, unpredictable ways. This suggested a dynamic and perhaps unstable interior, contradicting earlier models that described a relatively inert core. Adding fuel to the mystery, Neptune's atmospheric activity revealed patterns that had never been seen before. Historically, the planet has been home to massive storms, including the famous Great Dark Spot, a swirling tempest that rivals Jupiter's Great Red Spot. These storms had always fascinated scientists due to their sheer size and the way they seemed to appear and disappear over time. But now, newer imagery captured bursts of infrared and ultraviolet emissions unlike any previously recorded. These emissions came in sudden pulses, indicating rapid and possibly explosive reactions occurring deep within Neptune's cloud layers. Instead of a cool, calm ice giant, the data painted a picture of a world brimming with chaotic, high-energy dynamics. What made this even more compelling was the correlation between magnetic field distortions and atmospheric pulses. One set of pulses, recorded in succession over a 16-hour period, was closely matched with oscillations in the planet's magnetic field. This led scientists to theorize that Neptune might possess internal processes more akin to those found in active terrestrial planets, or even stars. The possibility arose that the planet's core might not be as solid or frozen as previously imagined. Instead, it could be a dynamic mix of superionic water, exotic ice phases, and metallic hydrogen, all contributing to unexpected interactions between the core and the atmosphere. Further baffling researchers was a sudden drop in stratospheric temperatures. Over a span of just two Earth years, data revealed that Neptune's upper atmosphere had cooled by nearly 10 degrees Celsius, contradicting earlier climate models that predicted a slow but steady warming trend. This dramatic cooling could not be explained by seasonal variations or solar radiation cycles alone. Speculation began to mount that Neptune might be undergoing a kind of planetary scale transformation. This was not a minor fluctuation. It indicated that something significant and perhaps systemic was happening deep within the planet. Theories ranging from magnetic pole reversals to shifts in internal convection currents were proposed, but no singular explanation fit all the observed anomalies. A particularly provocative development came when NASA's team, using data from gravitational field readings, proposed that Neptune might be harboring an anomalous internal structure, possibly a void or cavernous zone within its interior. These gravitational anomalies hinted at a massive region within the planet where density dropped unexpectedly, breaking from models that assumed a consistent compacted mass beneath its outer layers. If true, this would force scientists to rewrite not just Neptune's own geological profile, but potentially the way ice giants form altogether. 
This concept suggests a formation history that diverges significantly from both Uranus and the gas giants Jupiter and Saturn. Rather than forming as a gradual accretion of gas and ice, Neptune might have experienced a violent history, perhaps even a colossal impact early in its formation that left a hollowed scar within its core. Parallel to these discoveries, Neptune's ring system, a feature often ignored due to its faintness, started exhibiting curious behavior. For decades, the rings were thought to be relatively static, dim, dusty structures made from broken moons or cometary debris. Yet high-resolution imaging recently captured distinct movement and clumping behavior within the rings, implying active processes such as shepherd moons, gravitational resonances, or even internal ring dynamics. These changes were too abrupt to be accounted for by Newtonian physics alone, leading some researchers to suggest that Neptune's gravitational influence might be fluctuating, possibly tied to the core activity or magnetic disturbances. If a planet's gravity can change, even subtly, it challenges foundational physics about how mass behaves in celestial bodies. Then came one of the most bizarre findings yet, radio emissions that followed no known pattern of natural planetary radiation. They came in bursts, lasted for milliseconds, and repeated at irregular intervals. These weren't just typical auroral emissions, which are usually induced by interactions with solar winds. Instead, these seemed internally generated, almost like planetary heartbeats. Attempts to decipher them are still ongoing, but one thing is clear. They don't match emissions from any other planet in the solar system, and their irregularity makes them especially hard to classify. This led to an explosion of theoretical possibilities, from resonant waves moving through superionic ice to transient plasma loops forming spontaneously within Neptune's field-drenched atmosphere. With each new data point, the emerging picture of Neptune became increasingly alien. It was no longer just an icy outpost in the solar system, but a complex reactive body with secrets that challenged decades of astrophysical theory. What was once seen as a stable, well-understood member of the planetary family now appeared to be a volatile enigma. Some researchers even began drawing parallels between Neptune and exoplanets, especially those classified as hot Neptunes which orbit close to their stars and exhibit high levels of atmospheric escape and magnetic activity. Could Neptune be a bridge in understanding these exotic worlds? If so, it might provide an invaluable window into planetary systems far beyond our own. There's also growing suspicion that Neptune's anomalies might influence objects in its broader neighborhood. The Kuiper Belt, which begins just beyond Neptune's orbit, contains countless icy bodies, dwarf planets, and potentially undiscovered celestial entities. Any shifts in Neptune's magnetic field or gravitational pull could subtly alter the trajectories of these objects. Observational studies have already started noting orbital shifts in some of the larger Kuiper Belt objects' KBOs, leading to whispers in the astronomical community about whether Neptune might be exerting an unstable or changing influence over its environment. If Neptune is more dynamic than once thought, then it may be a central player in shaping the architecture of the outer solar system. Even Neptune's moon system has come under fresh scrutiny. Triton, its largest moon, already fascinated astronomers with its retrograde orbit and geysers spewing nitrogen ice. Now, newer scans of Triton's surface show irregularities in its crustal structure. Features that may have been triggered by interactions with Neptune's changing magnetic environment. It's even been speculated that Neptune's interior changes could be triggering internal heating on Triton through tidal or magnetic interactions. If Neptune can impact its moons in real time through magnetic and gravitational changes, it raises fascinating questions about the interconnectedness of planetary systems, especially in distant, cold regions of space. Some of the most striking implications of these discoveries concern planetary formation theory. For decades, the prevailing model held that the solar system formed in a gradual, relatively orderly manner with gas and dust coalescing into increasingly larger bodies. Neptune, being far from the Sun, was assumed to be composed largely of ices and lighter materials, forming slowly and without the intense heat and pressure that shaped the inner planets. But now, with signs of violent past events, dynamic internal activity, and unexplained structural anomalies, the assumption of a passive formation process is being eroded. It opens the door to the possibility that the early solar system was more chaotic, with Neptune perhaps having undergone collisions, migrations, or interactions with yet undiscovered massive bodies. 
These revelations also underscore a broader truth that is becoming increasingly evident. The outer planets are not the quiet, frozen worlds they were once imagined to be. Just as recent missions to Jupiter and Saturn have unveiled complex weather systems, layered internal structures, and possibly habitable moons, Neptune now stands at the frontier of discovery. What makes its case even more intriguing is the relative lack of direct exploration. Voyager 2 remains the only spacecraft to have flown by Neptune, and it did so in 1989, offering just a brief glimpse. Everything else we know has come from remote sensing and theoretical modeling. Yet even with these limited tools, the planet is revealing mysteries that are reshaping planetary science. The momentum behind Neptune research is rapidly building. NASA and other space agencies are discussing dedicated missions to explore the ice giant more closely, possibly with orbiters or even atmospheric probes that could penetrate its dense outer layers. Such missions could confirm or refute the current hypotheses about its magnetic anomalies, internal voids, and mysterious emissions. And while these missions are still in planning phases, the urgency is growing. Every new discovery suggests that Neptune holds not just planetary puzzles, but answers to universal questions about how worlds form, evolve, and behave in extreme conditions. Until then, Neptune remains a vibrant enigma, casting a long shadow across scientific assumptions. It serves as a reminder that the universe is not a static place filled with predictable mechanisms, but a constantly changing arena where even the quietest corners might be hiding immense untapped forces. As NASA continues to probe its secrets, one thing has become certain, Neptune is not what we thought it was, and that realization could change everything. If you liked this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, leave your comments below and tell us. What are your thoughts on NASA's warning? Is Neptune hiding something shocking? We want to hear from you. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.